All right, meanwhile, today was the day that the city's mask mandate for kids two to four years old was supposed to come to an end, but guess what? Not happening. Yeah, Mayor Eric Adams has decided to keep that mandate in place for now, citing an uptick in COVID cases, but as you might expect, not everyone agrees with this decision. Fox Fox's Reagan Medji is live in Astoria, Queens with more on this. Reagan, a lot of parents waited for this day. Definitely not the news that many were expecting. No, however, it isn't totally unexpected because if you remember two weeks ago when Mayor Adams made that announcement that April 4th, the masks will go off as long as the numbers stay low. That was the thing. He said as long as those numbers stay low. Turns out two weeks later, well, we got to put those masks back on for the kids ages two to four, because as you know, those are our youngest New Yorkers and they also aren't eligible to get vaccinated just yet. Cases are definitively rising and it's gotten our attention. New York City's Health Commissioner Dr. Ashwin Vassan is concerned about the highly transmissible BA2 Omicron subvariant, which is now responsible for most of the COVID-19 infections in the country and also here in the city. It's also more contagious than Omicron. And Dr. Vassan says children under five are especially vulnerable because they are not yet eligible to be vaccinated. We want to keep an eye on this latest uptick to ensure that our youngest New Yorkers remain safe. As a result, Mayor Eric Adams is extending the New York City mask mandate for children under five as COVID-19 cases creep up. It means now kids ages two to four must continue to wear masks at child care centers in New York City. I think it's imperative that due to the rise in cases that we're seeing, as slight as they are, our plans uh, were to take a week to assess the numbers before removing masks for two to four years old. According to the New York Times, over the last month, cases have grown from 500 daily cases in early March to more than 1,200 daily cases now. Based on the mayor's new color-coded alert system, the city is currently at a low-risk level of community spread. To keep it that way, the youngest New Yorkers must continue masking. It's been two years. I think at this point, it just needs to go away. I think we're getting there. I think it could be good for two to four. And then on Friday, a judge on Staten Island basically struck down that toddler mask mandate, saying it is unreasonable. The city appealed, and an appellate judge ruled in favor of the city. So kids, parents, masks will have to stay on for those under five years old here in the city, while they're at school or in the daycare center. That is for now. We're live here in Astoria. Reagan Meggie, good day in New York. Rosanna, back to you. All right, thanks so much, Reagan.